Yeah, I mean, it obviously helps out a lot. And, you know, last year going against them and, and this year, it, you know, makes the games easier. So we're really fortunate to have that. And, um, yeah, they're looking great so far. So it's going to be exciting to see how the year goes for them. Alex talked about playing faster because you're in year two. Man, you got way, way more than that. But can you get that sense that everybody that's back is kind of building on it? Yeah, 100%. I mean, everyone's been in it now for over a year. So, um not a lot's changed at all. If anything, it's simplified. So we're we're in a really good spot, and uh, yeah, guys are picking it up fast. So we're, we're, it's it's a lot smoother than it was at this point last year. How do the new additions like Tom Roach and Josh Richardson help with that defensive line? It's huge. Yeah, I mean to have depth like that and and guys who are playmakers, you know, helps a lot and um, definitely much needed. And we're really happy to have them. And yeah, I mean through the spring and you know it's only been two days, no pads. Um, they've looked really good, and I'm sure when we get the pads on, you know, they'll look even better. So it's kind of an awkward time now when you don't have anything on. So we're looking forward to Monday. Look, Sean talked about needing to be better consistently against the run. Obviously, it takes more than one thing to be good against the run. So yeah. like, what, where specifically do you think, like, in the front line, you can get better in that regard? Yeah, I think we already have gotten better at it. I think it was just more kind of the style of play, and, you know, I've kind of talked about that already. Um, you know, and we've made the necessary changes. And, you know, I think Alex talked about it a little bit yesterday. So, um, yeah, I mean, you guys will see it, you know, next week live in action. So it, it, it's been going really well. And, uh, yeah, and, you know, kind of like he was saying, you know, having guys like JFM and, you know, Roach, you know, come in, you know, that obviously, you know, you guys, we have a lot more depth. So everything, every single snap, you know, we have guys that are playing it the right way. Yeah, no, we talked, uh, we've known each other for a couple of years now, um, kind of always joking about playing with each other. So I've known him, you know, I've known, we've been watching him for a while and then, you know, see it up close and, you know, kind of talk to him about it. It's, it's cool because we see the game the same way. So kind of that whole like learning period um, of playing with a guy opposite you. I mean, we didn't really have that. It was pretty smooth sailing. Um, so that, that's pretty rare to have and to have that's huge. So we've kind of hit the ground running so far with it. Yeah, I'd say pretty similar. Um, you know, you know, guys that want to just get off the ball, get vertical, kind of you know run our track. Um, you know, we've played in kind of similar defenses in the past, so I think that's kind of why we see the game that way. And um, you know, we've had success playing that way, so that's why we just want to keep it that way. Remember a few weeks ago, you mentioned how these defenses were a true Vance Joseph. Yeah, I think it's just aggressive and attacking, and I think, you know, we're definitely there, and it's not just up front. You know, it's all three levels, and guys are really bought into that now, and, um, you know, new coaches we brought up, brought in really, you know, kind of believe in that. So, um, yeah, I mean, we have everybody on board, which is what you want. You know, they have 100% buy-in, so um, that's the big thing. You're going into, you know, year six. I mean, you're a high-motor guy. Do you change your approach to training camp at all, though? No, I mean, this is the best my body's felt. You know, I'm only 26, so, um, yeah, it's, luckily I didn't have to play during COVID where you have 25-year-old rookies coming in. So, um, but, yeah, no, I just got a great team around me, a great team here that really know how to take care of my body. So, um, yeah, the best I ever felt, put on some really good weight, so feeling good. But fans are going to be here tomorrow. Does that change practice at all? Yeah, I mean, it definitely brings a lot of energy, which is nice, and, um you know, right now everyone's excited because camp just started. But when we get to, you know, kind of, you know, week three, four, five, um, you know, it, it can be tough to get up. But, you know, we're all professionals. And then when they bring the energy, it obviously always helps. So definitely really excited to see them. What, what did it mean to you to be able to play, you know, I think every game last year, I'd say healthy the whole year. And what, what did you learn maybe about getting through an entire year that you can use going forward? Yeah, I mean, it was. Obviously, it was you know a good thing to play the whole year. I think, you know, if you look at my injuries or the reason why I missed time, you know, it's kind of freak things. You know, it was a guy stepping on your ankle, kind of out of the blue, and then I got COVID. So there's not, you know, or I broke my hand. You know, it's kind of just freak things. So, you know, the injury stuff. You know, you just gotta, you know, make sure you stay on top of your body and pray. So. Um, yeah, I mean, right now it's, you know, just take it day by day. And like I said, we got a really good team here and that have, uh, you know, really been helping. And 
um, you know, the more you're kind of in the NFL, the more you learn what you need, what you don't need. So, um, yeah. Thanks.